Welcome back to our Let's Play. We left off after we just discovered an amazing spawn in the nether. Got some bunch of items. Died a shit ton of times. Which is kind of embarrassing how much I died. Even off camera, I had to stop recording so I can get back and forth and I kept dying constantly. I did do some little bit of organizing, so I should just go check out the nether. I put this path here, I cut down the trees, get some wood. <coughs> Excuse me. Let's go back in the portal and we'll see all the stuff I did. I didn't do much. I just, like right here, I cut down all the trees and stuff, put torches everywhere and kind of extended this. I'm going to check out down there eventually, but what we need to do in this episode is the nether fortress, which the entrance is over here. I haven't been in, we've been, exp oh, English, we explored the bastion already. We got over all the chests and stuff we needed. We went all the way down there and everything. Now we got this. I haven't been down in here yet. Ooh. Yeah, I got gold on. Ooh, a chest. Hello, motherfucker. Okay. That was scary. Please don't blow me up, please. Get, go downstairs. Okay, let me see if we got the chest. A bunch of gold and a flint and steel. Okay. I'll go that way in a second. Because I know it's going to take a while and I do I have my fire resistance. I think I do. I do. Okay. We should be good. What do you have for me, Mr. Oglin? Piglin? I forgot what they're called, honestly. But let's go ahead of time and just flash potion. Just so we can be safe whenever I get ready to go to the blazes. Uh, that was pretty shitty stuff. Not much cool stuff. Uh, I don't know. Keep that. Dude, does that make a noise? It does. Huh. Come here, please. Hell yeah, you're dead. You can't hurt me. I'm invincible. Uh, do I need these? Probably not. Am I going to take some? Yeah. Uh, I'll just take it. I don't know what it's gonna. I'm not, I don't know what I'm gonna use it for. I don't really do potion stuff unless I absolutely need to, which is like for night vision. But other than that, ooh, chest. Other than that, most of my potions I get from like piglins or finding in chests or getting from witches. Ooh, another one, more gold. I'll take the saddle. I don't need another one of those. Um, flint seals. I know another chest. We're just getting really lucky. I should be marking where I'm going so I don't get lost, but oh well. That's the point of the adventure. Is this a dead end? Where does it go? It goes down. Okay, yeah, let's go back. I'll meet you when I find something interesting. He's around the corner. And he just left around the corner. Okay. I mean, getting some wither skulls would be fun if I can get... Oh, actually, let's say getting withers for um later. Because I, I did get a looting three um looting three sword from a pigland. Actually, not, not from the piglins. From the um the bastion. So I can use that to get the wither skulls, hopefully. Which would be hella fun. We're gonna to go this direction. There's nothing else over there, so we're just gonna take this one. And I can see a lot of tunnels to take. Hopefully they're dead ends. Blaze spawner. Okay, I gotta mark that. Actually. We got two turn-offs. Where does this go? This leads to nothing. Ooh, another blaze spawner. Okay. I know that's there, so we'll mark this one as well. We'll go down here and see what's here. The uh, dead end. Actually, is that a dead end? Is it? Is it a dead end? I can't tell. Yeah, it's a dead end. This is just an opening. Some glowstone, another tower. Part of the tower, at least. Let's check down here. This goes up. Is it another spawner? No, it's just this tower. That is a dead end, and that is a dead end. Okay, guess we're going. I already got dizzy. Guess we're going this way. Yeah, that's a dead end. That's a dead end. I'm gonna check all the other ones. 
hopefully there's something up here. If there's like three blaze spawners next to each other, it'd be pretty cool. I mean, already having two is just enough. Not like I'm going to be using them for a while, at least until later in the game. So blaze spawner there and blaze spawner up there. Okay. Where to go to next? There's really not much to explore in these things, sadly. So I might, ooh. I might just call it exploring this place and we'll do some things in the overworld. Maybe build some things out onto the base, do some cool stuff. So yeah, I'll see you there. We're back. Oh man, I need to eat. I'm always hungry every time we come back, but we need to sleep real quick just in case so I can get stuff started, started during the day. Oh, sleep. And it's daytime again. Excuse you? What are you doing on my property? You. What do you have? Nothing of interest. I do want your llamas, though. Y'all didn't see nothing. Y'all didn't see nothing. Y'all didn't see nothing. Okay. Hopefully they'll forget. Let's drop our inventory. All the stuff we don't need to use at the moment in here. Okay. What I need to do is get rid of this stuff. I hate floating trees. I hate, I do love these big trees, how they look. When it comes to cutting them down though, it's a pain in the ass. You have to climb in all those leaves and make sure you get in. If you leave just one, it's all gonna stay there. So I'm gonna cut that down real fast. Actually, I had a better idea. I'm just gonna burn it down. Cause I don't wanna waste time crawling up there, stacking blocks up, trying to find the wood. So we're just gonna burn it. Hopefully, it gets rid of everything. There we go. So first plan of business, I want to try to make a, take these animals, I want to separate them into individual things. I want to get rid of this whole thing right here and I'll build some plots. So like I'll put cows, sheep, chicken, pig, I'll just line them all up. But that's going to be troublesome because I know cows and sheep both follow wheat, which is going to be a pain in the ass to deal with. So I'll probably have to do chickens first and then pigs and I'll have to deal with them, the rest of them on my own in a way to get them all a little scattered. But I'm going to start digging this area out. I'm going to actually time lapse my digging just so we can get this thing done fast enough. So here we go. Okay, now that that's all cleared out, time to start the building process. Putting it all together, lining all things up. So, um, I need cobblestone and wood. So I want to make them sort of big. Let me think. So maybe like every five block, every 10 blocks actually. One, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. 10 blocks across and we'll go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. On there, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So we're a little bit short, but we'll clear that up in a bit. So we're gonna go 1, 2, 3, 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. And we got to do that over there. And then one, two, three, four. Okay, let's turn some of this into normal wood. So my plan is to be like stables, like a farm stable. So we're going to go get rid of this. 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All the way to the back. Do, 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 do. Da, 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 And, you know. We'll add on to that in a second. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna get the base structure done. I'm gonna pause real quick until I get that done and we're gonna build the rest. At least the, like, the outer line art of the building. Okay, I got the frame down that I wanted just real fast. I want to have it sort of like angled upward so it's gonna go down and then up. So how I'm gonna do that, I'm not completely sure, but I think if I just, actually let me use a placeholder of dirt to do it. Also I fixed this area up as well. I'm gonna get it done real fast, but I'm gonna go from there and I want it to go up over maybe should I go by one or two like one there and then it would go up and up one more maybe and we're gonna go out over go up two over let's go up three maybe like that i think it's curving too much i'm not sure and then we'll go again two three Oops, did I mess up somewhere? I don't think so. One, two, three. Okay, let's get rid of this and take a look. Oops, I got on the first try. If not, I'm gonna cry. Doom, 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 doom. Okay. I think that works, actually. Not too much of a curve, but it's also not too much of an angle. I think that works just fine. I am going to start building this, put it all together. Okay, we got this done. I had to do a little quick time lapse. I hope you guys enjoyed that cool little, um, oh my gosh, I'm on fire. I can't, the new angle I got, I got a little camera edit thingy so I can actually change the angles and perspective during time lapses, which is going to come in handy to get locks. So I'm going to enjoy doing that. At so much. Well, um, you shouldn't be there, and you shouldn't be there. But I know if I go near them, they're gonna explode. And I need food. Oh man. Where's my normal food? Where's my normal food? Bread. Okay, that works. That works just fine. Okay. Next thing up is getting fence posts and everything ready. So I will be back once I get that done. Fence posts are done. I'm just quickly before he gets here. Oh man. Okay. Oh shoot, he's going around. <laughs> uh, come this way, please. I don't want you to explode. I don't want you to explode anywhere here. I want you over here. Come on. Get over here. Don't blow up. Don't blow up. Don't blow up, please. Okay, we're good. Now you, you need to get out of here. Come on. This way. This way. Come on. A little faster. You can do it. One. <gasps> Don't. Don't. Okay, we're good. Time to put this together. There's that. And there's that. Okay. I did finish this one right here, and I just noticed something very, very kind of annoying. One, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four. And this is one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. This is one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, five. So it's uneven somewhere. I went wrong with the counting somewhere, but I'm too far ahead to fix it. So right now we're just gonna continue putting all this together. And we're gonna get the mobs. And we're gonna transfer them over.
Okay, the little barn is done. The next thing up is to transfer all the animals over. And that's gonna be hell. Get them all over one by one. So you know what I'm gonna do again? I'm gonna time lapse it again with the fancy angle. So you can watch me run around like little ants getting all these mobs separated. Here we go. There we go. We got the cows and sheep all moved over. We got the pigs in here and we got the chickens all moved. Ooh, there's some experience in there. Someone die or do they have babies? I'm not sure. But it's getting pretty late, real life and in Minecraft. So we got this thing built. If you did enjoy watching this video, please leave a like and subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.